All right, tubes. We got a little project here today. I'm gonna complete my air horn. I mean, my air compressor installation. That air tank in the bed here is nice, but the problem with it is that it's three gallons, so it takes it takes forever to fill up, and then uh, it takes a very short period of time to empty it down anyway. So it's not really practical to use for air tools and all that, but it is gonna be good for air horns. So I was uh, I was cruising down the highway. And uh, I don't know, this pipe must have rolled off a truck into my bed or something because it's a perfect size for an uh, air tank. And uh, I found these washers. What I'm going to do is I'm going to weld them on the end here as end caps. And then uh, I found some pipe fittings. I'm going to cut this in half. And we're going to weld one half on here. We're going to weld the other half on there. And that way we'll have a, a means of putting air into this thing and taking air out of it. So that's, uh, that's going to be the project today. All right, we're making progress here. I went ahead and welded the, the first one on there. And uh, I'm over here using Road King's welder. Say hey, Road King. Hey. And I got a little racer here, too. There we go. It's, uh, it's engine night, so I came over and I uh, used his welder. I figured I'd borrow his gas instead. You got enough wire? Plenty of gas? Got enough gas? I think so. I don't know. Looking a little low. Oh, well. So uh, what I'm going to do now is... Uh, Actually, I'll probably probably prep both of these and, and weld the one on on this side over here, and then uh, then we'll do the other one. Maybe I'll get a uh, road king to get some live. All right, footage. tubes. Let me go check up on a little fella for you here. Uh, what the hell's going on here? We changed our mind. We decided to tap this. Oh my. Uh oh. Hmm. I think I might have come in too fast. There you go. There you go. Can you see it? Yeah. What is that? Half inch? Uh, yeah, half inch pipe thread. Huh. You screwed every one into there now. I'll say. You can put a plug in there. You put a pipe in there. You put a fitting in there. Alright. Let me get a close up of it, buddy. Check out those threads. Uh, here we go. I'm liking it. Alright. Plug it up. Yeah. Look at him go. There you go. That's what I'm talking it's about. Sealed. Signed, sealed. sealed, and delivered, buddy. That's right. All, All right. right. What are you going to do next? I'm going to flip it over and weld the other washer on. All right. See you when you get there. We'll see you. That one wasn't as good. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Better than some of that chicken shit I see on the YouTube TV. Yeah. I'm finishing off here. You don't have to worry about your front end falling off with that kind of weld. Alright, just got done doing my second pass, so uh, I brought it inside to sand it down and get it ready for some paint. But I figured I'd uh, give you a look-see at my second pass here. It's Weave It Wednesday, so I decided to uh, hit it with a little uh, little double weave action. And uh, it actually turned out pretty good. It was the first time I ever tried that, but I was just uh, I was just going along and I decided to see what I could do with it. And it actually turned out pretty good. So uh, that's that. It's, uh, it's all ready. No leaks there, buddy. So we'll see when we get a paint job. All right, we got us here a uh, completed air tank. Paint job's all done, did about two coats on it, and uh, it, it turned out real good. Not that I uh, didn't expect it to, but I'm real happy with it. Nice and even, I uh, left it out in the rain last night to, to dry a little faster. So it's all ready to go. It's ready to get mounted on the truck now. Um, I have to say that this is gonna be a video. We're gonna call it here, and we'll uh, We'll see you guys again soon when we're mounting this on the Ranger. Okie dokie, tubes.